Today we're going to be doing a dementia simulator, a little POV, your family stuck you in a nursing home because you're senile simulator. We're taking a look at Oasis AI, which is Minecraft AI that you can play. And I haven't actually checked this out. This is uh, the first look as I'm recording this because I wanted the reaction to be genuine. You're about to enter a first of its kind video model, a game engine trained by millions of gameplay hours. Every step you take will shape the environment around you in real time. Choose a map. Where do we want to go? Village outpost, dense forest, rugged coastline, desert expanse, mountain meadow. Village outpost for sure. And after waiting 10 minutes, we can finally begin the journey. I guess that's why people plan out their videos, huh? But where's the fun in that? We've been sucked in, transported to the fucking AI Minecraft. Jesus Christ, these controls are clunky as shit. <laughs> it's like I'm playing with a Bluetooth connection to my brain. Holy shit, it's so trippy. It's like, <laughs> oh my god. I feel like I'm losing my mind live on stream. It, stream? I'm not even streaming. See, I'm losing my mind. We're Okay, we're in the snow biome now. We were not in the snow biome a second ago. We were in a village. And, oh, I can place fences. This is cool. This is good. This is good. Okay, uh, are animals spawning from that? Can I eat a carrot? Holy fuck, that's a sheep. It's trying to, it's a sheep amalgamation is anamorphing in front of me. The, the fence is gone. All my hard work destroyed. How do I open my inventory? E. I have a different inventory in here. What? Let's try to break stuff. Wood? It says I'm holding wood. I'm holding wheat. Oh my lord. We got two minutes and 40 seconds left. We got to make it count. Let's dig straight down. Dig straight down. Oh, shoot. Oh, my God. That's like a transition in a horror movie. Oh, fuck. Is that a creeper? Oh, my God. This is like a, this is turned into a horror film. I stared down at the darkness for so long, it took me into a cave. This must what This is like a, it's like a, this feels like a mushroom trip. It's like I just took DMT. I just took the biggest hit of DMT in my entire life, and now I think I'm in Minecraft, but in the real world, I'm about to run out of fucking window. So it appears the AI has froze. The generation has stopped generating. Well, I guess this gives me a moment to talk about how cool this real-time generation of a video game is. Cool, I gotta wait another queue. Well, instead of just powering off for like eight minutes and blankly staring until I'm able to go in, I wanted to look at their Twitter to see if they put out anything interesting. So this is some interesting tweets someone said they're skeptical about this simply because of the compute cost and they said we're actually running this for much cheaper than what a user pays for an average hour of a steam game especially for this kind of groundbreaking technology because it's the first of its kind real-time generation that's interactive and then someone said i wonder how something like this might handle multiplayer mode and they said wait till v2 so i'm assuming v2 they're going to attempt to do multiplayer which that is that I'm, I'm very intrigued on how that's going to function and just by looking at their website, you can see here it says the first real-time generative AI open world model. And they have like examples of the gameplay that you're going to witness, which is not this smooth. It's a lot more uh, fever dreamish. It literally, it's like you're experiencing and interacting with a dream. I remember one time I had a dream where I had like a gigantic penis, like literally bigger. Like it was like, a, it was like wrapped up in a bandage and everything. And it was like fucking like a, an elephant trunk. It was like a log, man. Like so unusably big that it was just a hindrance. And I literally got locked up in like a, a lion cage, like a circus cage. And people were pointing and laughing at me, treating me like I was some freak. Which, to be fair, if someone had that big of a penis in real life, they would be a freak. <laughs> Take me to the promised land. Oh my god, I move like I'm in a dream also. It's like someone's chasing you and you can't run. <laughs> I find that if you just stare down, it kind of just freaks out and wants to fill in and interpret and create. But it's just, it just makes me drop forever on the grace. Like on stone, it just makes you drop. It actually takes physics into account, like Minecraft physics. You can't break, like it breaks faster with a pickaxe and whatnot. So now I'm in a, I'm in a ravine. Health doesn't matter, apparently. You can just fall forever if you do this. Like, I'm literally just sinking into an infinite gray void now. I've tickled, I've uh, tickled my AI pickle enough for this video. I think my itch has been sufficiently scratched. And other than that, 
That's been AI Minecraft. Welcome, or thanks for joining me in this dementia simulator, and I'll catch you in the next one.